Hello again everyone, I'm Jim, welcome to another video. Now we have two very, very surprising releases actually from Ubiquity. One of them's very much a surprise because it appears they're finally listening to their audience. As you can see it in front of you. This is the G4 Doorbell Professional PoE Kit. Now, this from the front may look like a normal G4 Doorbell Pro, but it is not. This is a Doorbell Pro with Chime where both of them can be PoE powered directly. The Chime obviously previously was Wi-Fi which needed to be plugged into a power socket somewhere and obviously the Doorbell Pro was USB-C powered or AC powered. This however is purely PoE powered. So again very much the same as the normal Doorbell Pro except without the ability to be powered via an existing Doorbell uh, transformer or via USB-C. So what differences does this have above and beyond? Well, if we scroll down and have a look at what is in the box, uh, you will see that we have the standard doorbell sort of looking device. But on the back of that, there is a RG45 port for plugging in a PoE network cable. Uh, we have a slightly different set of standoffs uh, for the actual doorbell itself. We've got the angled one. I don't think, I don't remember seeing this one in the... Uh, standard doorbell pro and we have a flush mount one as well we get the uh, poe chime as well with a recessed and obviously uh, recessed mount and a standoff mount you've got a, a grommet to uh, ensure that the cable going into the back of your doorbell remains waterproof and the standard array of mounting screws now what this means is you now have the ability to power a g4 doorbell pro via poe and the chime as you can see here some pictures of it being recessed in which has been asked for for quite some time in fact since the doorbell launch the standard g4 doorbell launch people have been asking for poe way uh, powered versions um obviously there have been some unofficial ways of powering them as well um i've done a few videos on that but other than this being poe powered it's the same as a normal doorbell pro um hopefully we will get now make the ability to edit the welcome screen on them that was promised to us quite some time ago when it launched. Um, no news as to whether the thumb and fingerprint sensor is gonna be working yet or not, but you can see pretty much it's a, it's a POE powered doorbell. Now, the second thing, we have an AI Pro. So the AI Pro, uh, this popped up briefly on Reddit a few, well, about a week ago with the uh, latest video from Ubiquity with someone putting some pictures up of this. Uh, it has now officially launched. Uh, the AI Pro is the uh, professional version of the AI Bullet, meaning that we get uh, obviously a nice pretty black camera instead of the normal sort of whitish colored one. Uh, we gain a 4K 8 megapixel lens in this above the 2K uh, video resolution of the normal AI bullet uh, we get optical zoom so we get three times optical zoom and then we get the uh, we get a two-way audio but we also gain the advanced AI which means that this camera has the ability to not only detect people um, and obviously cars but it can read not license plates and anything else that ubiquity will be adding into the range much and above that it's pretty much the same as a normal pro i mean it's been iko4 resisted uh, rated which means it can withstand a bit of, a, of abuse but above and beyond that it's uh we got ip65 rating again pretty much the same as every other pro camera but the license plate recognition is a game changer in this level of camera because obviously it was missing from the G4 Pro and the G3 Pro was uh, never that much of a great camera to start with. So new cameras from Ubiquity. Give us a uh, comment on uh, your thoughts on it down below. Um, but uh, there you go. Some nice shiny new toys from Ubiquity for people to uh, start having a look at. If I get hold of one, I'll do a review. Anyway, thank you for watching. Um, please feel free to like, share, comment as ever, and subscribe. Uh, and I will catch you again in the next one.